This is And World News, reporting on a significant development in the ongoing conflict on the independent island of Altis, occurring against the backdrop of the recent attack on the AAC airfield, now 10 days past. In a recent skirmish between AF and NATO armoured units, tensions reached a boiling point as an AFAP unleashed a devastating barrage upon a NATO Merkava tank. The AF's precise fire targeted the Merkava's main barrel, rendering it incapacitated and forcing the NATO vehicle to retreat under fire. However, the retreat was short-lived as an AF drone, hovering above the battlefield, seized the opportunity to strike. With deadly accuracy, the drone swiftly detonating its onboard IED, culminating in a catastrophic explosion that obliterated the retreating Merkava. In a tense encounter deep within the dense woods of Altis, um, if drones have proven to be a formidable force, two NATO recon soldiers found themselves targeted by an AAF drone while conducting reconnaissance operations with swift and deadly precision. The AAF drone unleashed an IAD, resulting in a devastating explosion that claimed the lives of the NATO soldiers. Good evening, viewers. This is AN World News, bringing you live coverage from the independent island of Altis, where a city is under siege following a devastating attack by CSAT forces. Our camera team is on the ground, capturing the unfolding chaos as local police desperately fight to repel the invaders. In the early hours of the day, Altis awoke to the sounds of explosions and gunfire as CSAT forces launched a brazen assault on the city. The streets are now a battleground, with smoke billowing into the sky and the roar of combat echoing through the air. Our cameras have captured harrowing scenes of destruction as buildings are reduced to rubble and civilians flee for safety. The police force, outnumbered and outgunned, is putting up a fierce resistance against the well-equipped and highly trained CSAT troops. NATO forces have dealt a decisive blow to see SAT aggressors, demonstrating their military prowess in a fierce aerial engagement. Moments ago, a NATO MQ Falcon, hovering stealthily above the battlefield, locked onto not one. But two CSAT helicopters prowling the skies with hostile intent. With pinpoint accuracy, it unleashed a volley of missiles sending the enemy aircraft spiralling down in flames. The destruction of these CSAT helicopters marks a significant victory for NATO forces, crippling the enemy's aerial capabilities and shifting the balance of power in their favour. Buoyed by this success, NATO ground forces launched a coordinated assault, swiftly moving to capitalise on the momentum gained from the aerial skirmish. With overwhelming firepower and tactical precision, they advanced, driving back the remaining CSAT forces with relentless determination. 